Businesses owners in Southeast Portland say it's an ongoing frustrating problem, especially amid this pandemic. Look at this. Yeah, we're talking about graffiti, only this time the taggers were caught on camera, as you can see right here. Our Fox 12's Haley Rush joins us now live with a look at that video of Fox 12's Most Wanted. Haley? Well, we lost track when we went out there of all the businesses on Hawthorne tagged on the same exact night. But business owners tell me they're hoping that video is the key to catching these vandals. This overnight surveillance video shows two taggers in action on Hawthorne last weekend. They take a look around, then both get to work tagging the bar Gold Dust Meridian. Also hit the same night with similar symbols and markings. A string of other businesses nearby, though it's unclear if it's the same people. It's not cool. Eric Eisenhardt is an employee at Wildish Botanicals on Hawthorne. He says most months there's going to be something on the shop's walls outside, but added that it hurts a little more during such a tough time. We don't appreciate it at all. Um, we're a small business here. We have our hands full. Gold Dust Meridian's Facebook page reads, It is hard enough to be closed with the financial uncertainty of reopening. We are struggling just like everyone else. We have spent over $1,500 to date removing graffiti and trying to keep the building in repair. The same post also asks for the public's help in identifying the taggers. We're trying to keep places nice for people and customers, and it's not appreciated at all. I hope this video discourages further tagging. I really do. Most cities across the metro have a graffiti abatement program. The city of Portland has a portion of its website dedicated to reporting graffiti. Reporting live tonight in Southeast Portland, Haley Rush, Fox 12 Oregon.